Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel today. I'm deeply, deeply sorry that there has hardly been in, uh, there has been lack of uploads within the channel. Now, only f reason why I'm saying that is because, well, um, I've been working quite a lot, and that's the only reason I can actually use to explain, really. <laughs> But yeah, we're back today with some Horizon Forbidden West. We're going to crack on. We're going to get onto it. And yeah, with that being said, let's get into the video. Running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AI you designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead... It comes to nothing. And every night, I have the same dream. Starting cinematics. A little bit too long, if you ask me. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky. Through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center... I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. Screenshot. Thumbnail. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So... What are we doing? 
must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. You're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. <laughs> okay. But, if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. A focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? Grapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. Well, well, here we are now, finally at the start of the game. Um, we've got Var. We, oh, we've been hunted. That we've been tracked by Varl, who we saved in the uh, well, you know, the first one. If you guys ever played it. Just got to pick up some medicinal plants now. Oh, oh, oh right. Ugh. Bitter? Here we go. Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Right, can we jump up now? Let me jump up. Here we go. Plants along the way. Yes, mate, we will. Yeah, good idea. More blight. It's everywhere. This is destroying the planet. Some of the blight is... It's peeling off. Dead skin. Is that how it spreads? Ugh. You know what, right? <coughs> Social anxiety Those disorder... Ruins. That's where we need to go. ...is a pain in the ass. I don't know who put these ropes here, but... Because nine times out of ten when I listen down. to myself doing these videos, I just come across, like, you know, the backup? boring. Well, um, and it's, it's annoying, an you know, I just, it's, um, I want to be like a normal person and talk, think of it but like a set of I find it hard for some reason, and I have no idea why. <laughs> like, you know, like, you know how the saying goes, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. It's like... And there they go. I can't, um... Looks like they left a carcass behind. Wait, where, where are we going? Down here. Yeah, so... It's like I can't teach myself how to... A lot of arrows in that machine. How to interact properly and talk to look. people properly. Wait, let's... Pick up some wood. Pick up some ridge wood. What them arrows. Because we got none. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? Is that, that a scrapper? I don't know. We'd craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble with that. Good thing we already picked up some Ridgewood. Yep, that was a scrapper. All right. Now to craft some arrows. Yeah, I'll craft them. Ladder. Oh, I missed you. Well arrows ready. Just have to target the lock. 
try and get through this part as quick as we can because the prologue is so long. What was this place? I don't know. Hmm. The transmission, the uh, message I found, didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was Just a fuss as much. when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. Down this way. You were right about that. Oh, here we go. Get to the cross. It's a new machine. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Take a little booger out. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. It's I. It's a weak spot. That's it. Good lad. Okay. Concentrate. Easy. Another one's coming. Oh, really? Where? Oh, right there. How does the focus know all that? It reads data. You go at this one hit. Like a hunter studying its prey. One hit, one uh yeah. kind of. Give me some more medicinal bearings. So after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration is over, my mother said you had a full child, right? Yeah. As quick found as we my can. first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Going into a ruin of the old ones. God has protect us. We'll be okay, Varl. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Yeah, we don't want to watch you, don't we? I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a back? Through the door, the let's go. Should be able to pry this open. I guess they want us to check in with them. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Ugh. What's that stench? The entire camp. Oh. Wiped out. They must have come here to Dell for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. Yeah, but what left it? And it looks like something big came in from above. Crash right above. through the camp. Jesus. And through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Yep. We'll quickly have a look at that now. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris. Would you reckon? Do you reckon it's a new machine? Through. I don't know. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. I don't know how many new machines have been added hey, into this one. Here. I think I got something. But you got Vile? What you got, mate? It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. Yes, good idea, Val. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Right there. Poor guy. Pick this up. Acid burned right through his armor. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. But you run over it. Pick that up. Part of a machine. Could help fix the gears. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. 
Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Right, let's make ourselves a pool caster. Nice. Right, so we got the pool caster now. There. Uh, pool now caster. Now we just pull the, the debris board. out the wall. Yes, I know. Thank you. Home free. That worked better than I thought. Huh. What's this thing for? What you found? I'm Oswald Dogger, and oh. it is my pleasure to, to get introduce you to Far Zenith. Go. You you wow, that works. The pool caster could even be used as a grapple. Too bad there's only one. Brilliant. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. <laughs> Shimmy across. Oh. Where in this auditorium? Oh. Oh. Find out. I'm falling off. Okay. Oh, this is brilliant. Drop the Give me the chest. Find anything good? The key. A few supplies. You got borrow. Thanks. Oh, mate, we're going through. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our governments abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. Oh, what's just going on there? A serious system. There will create humanity's first off world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. Because the playback stopped. Oh, corrupt data, the really? Old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes. Oh, well, no, we don't want to skip. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Oh, yeah. No. Reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability. New biocontagions. Rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. 
infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction, a state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements, and you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. They just didn't know how... yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity... it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. All right, let's go. Oh, no. Uh, I went the wrong way. The wilds have really grown over this place. Like another job for the pink car start. Make the noise! Jeez, it's not that much noise. Creepy ruin we go. Oh, what is that, bro? I'm gonna open the chemical saucer and keep your guard up. Oh, my guard is up. Excuse me, can I have that rock? Thank you. <coughs> Jump. Up here. Another cutscene, though. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Now this is where proper stealthiness comes into it. Moving up. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. There. Now to take it down with the spear strike. I can throw a rock to distract it. Yes, and we did distract it. Position where I can sneak up and strike. Yeah! Oh. Inhumane right there, weren't it? That's how I'm dealt with. Mine's down too. Right, Varl's dealt with these. Continue. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle. Got one there. I can get it closer to us. There's a good little burrower. Come over here. That's it. Whenever you want to strike. But wait for it. That still counts as a stealth kill? Wow. Where is he? There he is. Come over here, big man. The bushes, stay in the bushes. Can you stroll over here a little bit quicker, please, mate? We can do it. Give me that rock back. Oh, oh he's so viral. That's <laughs> sake. We like viral. 
I've been meaning to mention. You got away with that. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Not good. Sorry, my whiskers offend you. Anointed. The Osra must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines just must have broken through. Everything just to uh, like you know. I'll keep this for later. Why is that Osra didn't have a chance to use it? Traps. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. Dismantled it. And not blow yourself up. More supplies. Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. No, I, I don't want to make some traps. Machines. Good idea. Okay. I should have what I need to craft a trap. We don't need to craft traps. We go it out here. Machines ahead. Don't think they spotted us. I've seen this machine before. A scrounger. It's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe we should craft some traps. It could help us get by. Special patrol route we want. I highlight track. I like track. We want you right here. <laughs> to swipe you on one. Let's keep going then. More Ridgewood. Um. Oops. More supplies quickly. Idea where that new big machine is, though. <laughs> We're gonna have to wait and find out. Whoops, wrong button. That's a big storm picking up out there. Yeah, and they're getting stronger and more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes are choked with algae. You were born to fix all that. Yeah, but I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Pull that down. Well, it is a thousand years old. Um, I'll find them that way. Looks like some kind of meeting room. More cutscenes! On to. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering. An obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. 
In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Prawl. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Varl. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus, but for now... The report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Alright, let's continue rushing through here. What have you found? Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. What's that? I found something you could use. What you found? Weapon. Thanks, Varl. Oh, thanks, mate. We should keep moving. Thanks. After you. Uh oh. Come on then. It's a blast thing. Yeah, thank you. Now it wants to work. Let's go. Down here. I think we're almost back outside. Good. Look, that must be the machine. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Great. That was dealt with easily. Shot two bits of it and it died. Noish. Do you know where we're going? Follow me, Varl. I know where we're going. I think. Said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. Wow. All those places I've been that these last few months. Looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the but stars. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow. Oh no, we got machine. some machines. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. Behind him before he sees us. Oh, we could have given him a silent strike, right? So we got him. Anyone want that? Who's alerted? Him. Here 
Here he comes. Mr. Scrounger himself. A little stealth cue out of the way here. right in the eye. Turn around and face me. Are you going to let me... There we are. Dealt with. Okay. Now how to get out of here. Machine ripped right through the wall. Well, it's like that's where we're going then, where the machine ripped through. There's a ladder here, mate. Pop some more arrows. It's always nice to have max arrows. Because you never know when you're going to get into a fight. Come on, up we go. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the Sacred Lands? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Was she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. <laughs> We're just gonna keep going out. Whoa! We're just gonna keep going out. Oh, that's where we need to go. Another cutscene. That's what we are, they're snakes. Three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? I'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy! Trust me. And there she goes. Just need to get open. We're coming down. Right. Got some machines here. We've got borrower, let's take you. Another borrower. There's another machine there as well. I can make it to that tower. I should be able to find it. No. To the shuttle. Shut up. You didn't. Yeah. <coughs> Rookie mistake by myself. Uh, excuse me. Okay, that was weird. Oh no, 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 no. Been too long here. When in doubt, pat them out. That's weird how this one died though. He died after he borrowed. That was just weird. Anything else here? No, fantastic. We can keep going. The max arrows. There. That ladder can get me up to the tower. Right, let's use it then. Can reach it if I launch myself off that grapple point. Okay. 
So all along there were three giant machines killing Osirum and leaving us right, everywhere. So um <sighs> great. We need to get to the shuttle. It's a very long prologue. Well that sounds good. That poor castle comes in so much handy, man. Easy. Before you fall off. Uh, uh, that was close. That rickety tower down. On to the next. I won't be able to make that jump. I'm just uh, trying to get through this prologue as quick as I can for you guys. Oh no, the rope broke! My God, this place is barely holding together. Right, we're at. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall right into the basin. Right. I've got all the machines tagged. So let's go and get them one by one. Machines in my way. Dealt with. Need you to come like right here. See it? Come very, very close. Get my rock press as well. Thank you. Listen, mate, can you come right here? Yeah, I'm I'm very sorry. I really am very sorry that I'm not really talkative, but I'm trying to learn, I'm trying to better myself and break myself out of this uh, state of mind that I've been in for quite some time now. It's a very, very hard habit to break, but you know, as day by day goes, I'm learning. But anyways, if you are enjoying today's video, just remember to leave a like on it. Cables. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Oh, well, there we are. Now, how to get up the tower? Scanning with my focus up here. Pull that bit out now. Get me out of here! <laughs> To the shuttle to the there. Shoot the shuttle cable connectors. Well, Mildred, that's the plan. I've. Where we go? Do we jump? We jump somewhere, don't we? Yeah, we definitely don't go this way about. Oh wait, there we are. Okay, the creaking doesn't sound good. I'm gonna have to detach those cables quick. Yeah, before we really badly hurt ourselves. 
This should be the right spot. Wait, hey, jump up. There. The connector. Ding dongs together. It should break. One down. I just need to climb higher. Watch the second set of cables. Round and round and round we go. Well, we stop an ancient no rickety tower with killer machines waiting down below. Maybe you're almost right. I'm a daily office, isn't it? Potion, fantastic. Almost there. There's the other connector. Another cutscene. Yeah, get the snakes. to hit that right there. Too quick. It's dead. Finally. I may have to up my difficulty up if it was that bloody easy. Oh, the data it. center should be straight ahead. I guess we're always gonna have to find another way there. Right, let's get to this data center then. And then see how we look like from there after. Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia, fix the system, heal the Blight, restore Elizabeth's dream. But is it still there? Well, we're gonna find out if it is, because we're running for it now. I'm close. I have to be. Another cutscene. <sighs> it's here. Gaia version six point nine. Initializing. Hello. Hi. Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? 
a farzine the conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia, and her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. You want me to handle this, Liz? <laughs> Blasphemers, brew the vipers. With a mighty hand, I smite and pour troubles upon you. Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. I got it. Farrell, I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know? But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farrell. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone. Varl, I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... Oh, we got about the Meridian. Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually... I've got a better idea. New intro, the point of the lance. Savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Make way. Murad, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashain, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. Oh, let's go climbing up the spire now. I wouldn't mind that. Watch your step. 
You saved us all, to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling about this. I could pull this thing out of the place. Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Yes, let's go spire climbing. To this one and jump back onto that one then before I get too hasty remember should be able to get up there now I thought silence was helping me when he gave me his lance but it looks like he tricked me I transmitted something through the spire did he save Hades If I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Hopefully the transmission note at the top will tell me. Ugh. Hey, that was a good spy climb. An elevator? Let's see. I see you finally figured it out. 
To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You rigged the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be... extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. Or why to obtain one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding. If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. Yes. Well, the coordinates make it simple enough. Even for you. I'm really done. Okay. Someone quickly let him know. He went inside it and it transformed. Almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. That can be difficult. West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated. And indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you. And attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Ah, the Sun King. Hey, more chatting. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. Uh, Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit, Vinasha. Quick, better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. That's why. Right, guys, with that being said, we're going to end off the first episode here because it's going to be a, a very, very long one, which obviously, you know, I do apologize about, but th that's the thing with these games that are coming out nowadays. The prologues just keep getting longer and longer and longer. I don't even think I finished it. But um, we'll finish it in the second episode. But with that being said, guys, thank you for taking time out of your day to watch my video. Once again, I do apologize for lack of videos. You know, everything 
personally is just out of my hand at the moment and I'm trying my best to work around everything um I'm still going to work on you know confidence within myself and talking throughout the videos and all that I will work on that and you know any advice you guys could give me in the comments section will be very much appreciated but with that being said guys thank you for watching today's video if you are new around here subscribe like the video if you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one keep smiling stay positive and peace